family. Good afternoon, man. So, I was up real late last night. I'm thinking, wait a minute, four something, five a.m. After I got done cleaning the garage, um, fucking puppies was yelling all goddamn night. And the reason they was yelling is because I gave Navy water right in front of them. And I left a water bowl in front of the fucking, uh, in front of their box. And I ain't put it back in the box after the Navy drunk his water. So all night they yelling, I'm trying to go sleep on the couch. But I just got through watching Snowfall like around four something. And, uh, man, I kept waking up shit. And I realized why they was yelling. Um, I realized why they was yelling. I realized why they was yelling, man. I put the water in there. And they ass went head first, dove in the water. And, you know, enjoyed their water, man. They was thirsty, I guess. So, this is around 7 a.m. I went into the room, took my ass to sleep. No one I supposed to get my hair done at 12 30. I set the alarm clock at 11. Cut the alarm clock at 11. Looked at my phone, told myself, get my ass up. I look back at the alarm clock, it's 12 o'clock, I'm supposed to be there at 12 30. I hear the girl tell her I'm be late. She said the 15, she said after 15 minutes of late charge, I said, cool. I get there 45, 50 minutes late, she said it's too late. Gotta reschedule. I thought I drove down an hour to that motherfucker. Now I'm driving back home. I didn't even clean my outside kennel, man. Um, like around 9 this morning, I woke up again because I heard the goddamn truck, the damn garbage truck, and I know I need to take the, the shit that's in the backyard um, to the front yard, you know, dispose of the shit and all that, so I had to do that, which I was, uh, thought I missed the damn trash, but I really did, but they come by twice to recycle, so I guess when they see my, my shit, uh, not the recycle, but just like the boxes and all that. So when they see my stuff still in the trash can, they they took that. So that was good. So now it's all uh, it's 1:40. I'm headed back to the crib. I'm trying to miss my damn exit. So yeah, it's 1:40. I'm headed back to the house. I stop, grab me some lunch. Have my lunch clean the outside kennels and then we're gonna take uh I'm gonna take the puppies and get their ears cropped man so I catch y'all back at the crib just finished cleaning all the damn kennels out hey mama I know y'all be liking to see the, you know, the first interaction with the dogs and shit, but I raise these dogs, man. There's, there's nothing to be expected, bro. set up this new arrangement for these dogs. Nyla's no longer going outside in the backyard. When she got to use the bathroom and we take her on walks and all that shit. All front yard, all front yard type shit. No more risky shit. No in the mood to deal with this shit. Will be 
channel for the duration, the duration of her stay here at NBO Estate. Keep saying we right now I'm gonna go get my puppies prepped. Go with their ears cropped today. See you later, Niva. Be a good girl, I'll be back. See you soon. Now you in the AC. You should be happy. Still panting like it's hot in here, but it's 72 degrees in my house. But she pants cause she has a crazy drive like this. I don't know, bro. I'm not, I'm not the only fucking nurse or doctor. I don't want to make logic of any other shit no more. All I say it is, it's what it is. It's what it is. Catch you guys in the next scene. So yeah, man, we're getting all ten dollars ears caught right now. Um, I'll do another video, or update video later. We just made it to the spot. One of the dogs shitting in the kennel like y'all know they always gonna do. Everything, a trip don't go the way you want it to go because they ain't the way the shit go. You know what I'm saying? So we here getting the dog dropped off. Get that shit going. We're gonna go. Uh, me and my boy Hector, we gonna go get a uh, clean the kennel and all that type shit up. And uh, we're gonna slide back, man, pick the dogs up, and I'll show y'all a little video once I make it back to the crib with the new crop, man. Of course, they're gonna look completely different. And today is the last day. What a special is over with at midnight. The special is over with at midnight, man. But yeah, I'm gonna tap you guys in. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next scene. Your crop. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bro, I cannot wait. I know a lot of y'all looking at my dog, you see they small, trust me, bro. Small dogs, bro. Small dogs. They small. But they would not be small. That's the girls right there, yo. Well, you got the fresh crop, man. My boy had to sleep with me, man. We've been, it's been a long motherfucking day. My boy been grinding with me. We've been up early doing this shit, knocking this shit out. Feel good to have, you know what I'm saying? Somebody with me, they got the same mindset, same fucking drive with me. Um, interacting with these folks with me, man. Yo, some beautiful shit, man. I want to say thank y'all. I really do appreciate y'all so much for rocking with me. Comment on the video. Subscribe to the channel, man. Somebody, uh, somebody sent me a uh, comment on the video and said a name. I think it was Katana. And I ain't going to lie, bro. Katana just, it, it uh, stuck out, man. <laughs> so I might fuck around and name a Katana, man. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with Katana. That's that's a cool ass with name, man. So, I think we're gonna rock with Katana, man. I think I'm gonna name it Katana. Katana, bring your ass here. Katana, sit down. Sit your head down, Katana. So, I fuck with it, man. So, we're gonna name her Katana. Chocolate Tri Tick. Black Chocolate Tri Tick. Name is Katana. So, what we're gonna do is over the next few days, we're gonna get some treats and shit like that. We're gonna teach her her name. Teach her, uh, when I say Katana. You know, I'm gonna show y'all how to teach a dog their name, man. So we're gonna we're gonna do that. I'm gonna record that process. My boy gonna hear me. We're gonna we're gonna knock it out, man. Um, so yeah, we're just chilling right now, man. I think we're gonna let Medusa uh, out and you know just let her run around with the tunnel, man, and just uh just let them play. I might record that. I just wanna uh just wanna say thank y'all so much, man. We just dropped the bag. I'm getting the dog ears caught, man. We moving up. At midnight, the price is no longer 3 k It's back to 4500 And you got a problem with my prices, man. They just don't fit your budget, my boy. And that's just what it is. It's that simple. These dogs will be very large. These dogs will be the largest dogs I've ever produced so far. Um, I'm very excited. I'm very, very excited to see them grow. Um, tomorrow, me and my boy, we're going to go check out, go to Trust Supply Company. We're going to go get another kennel. I think I'm going to get a 10x10 10 10, uh, chain link and just put it on the back of the corner of the, uh, of the fence and just let the, let the keepers. Well, matter of fact, I'm going to get that whole 10 just run around the backyard, put a dollhouse in that motherfucker, and we're just going to run it like that. And um, just watch them grow, man. Just watch them grow. 
Um, we do have dogs leaving next uh, two weeks once I get the ears, uh, the stitches removed out the ears. We have my three or four dogs leaving next week. Um, thank y'all for shopping with me. It's been a long process. In a week from now, um, we're taking the other nine to get their ears cropped. It's one day at a time, man, one day at a time. Um, thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. It's been a long, long day. It's been a very beautiful day. I missed my hair appointment this morning, but everything worked out however it needs to work out. There's no sweat, no pressure behind. Absolutely nothing. Thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. And I will have updated pictures of the puppies once I get the stitches taken out. And um, the growth spurt on me, puppies gonna come, man. It's gonna shock all y'all. People that bought dogs already, you just, you just locked yourself in, man, with some of the best blood. Eye job on mama and daddy's side. Um, boss of blood on mama and on mama side two times. Big shit, big, big shit. These dogs will be the biggest dogs I've produced so far. I'm super excited to see them go, man. Um, I think um, Nyla puppies was a week early. So if you're looking at the puppies and you're looking at them small, they came too soon, man. They wasn't supposed to even, they weren't due for another week, but she pushed them out and we, we kept them alive, we kept them grinding, we kept them working. They're still eating good, they're still drinking good, they're still playing good, they're still, they're very vocal, very playful. So, um, as far as size and all that shit, the, the size is gonna come. The size is gonna come, the head gonna come. Nyla got one of the biggest heads, and Zeus is just absolutely amazing. I'm very, very excited to watch him grow. It's been a very, 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 very day-to-day um, -day process. No pressure behind none of this shit, man. Thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. And shout out to y'all, man, for being, um, so 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 strong with me man so uh um, so helpful man y'all 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 make this shit possible man y'all make me keep going my boy hector has been a, a huge inspiration to me um whenever i get down about some shit or i don't feel like shit going the way i think it should go he let me know that i'm i'm way ahead of a game man and how i'm doing shit how i'm interacting with y'all and how, how i've been so close in contact with the puppies and watching them go and recording it there's no other channel out here like that. And uh, we're gonna continue to grow from this, man. Continue to build on this. And uh, we're gonna continue to move forward, man. It's your boy EJ, NBA Kennel. Nothing before family, man. And, uh, I love y'all, man. I love y'all so much. And I uh, wanna say thank you, man. And thank you to my boy, man, for rocking with me all day, man. Dog shit in that motherfucker. We pulled over the gas station. We cleaned the kennel out. My boy took the whole thing apart. Helped me clean that bitch out. It's just been one of them days, man. And no matter what we're going through, man, we wake up every day and we do the shit that we need to do. And that's what it's about, man. So I love y'all. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. It's your boy EJ, man.